Fans. Live from Midland, Odessa, and Big Spring, this is ABC Big 2 News at 10. Now at 10, Midland ISD is weighing if it will need more money to accommodate the influx of students expected in the coming years. Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Madeline Bierster. Tonight, we're hearing from the district on what the bond committee is expecting to spend that money on. That discussion was scheduled for tonight's school board meeting, but because time ran out in tonight's meeting, Midland ISD postponed the hearing to Thursday's bond meeting. Superintendent Dr. St Stephanie Howard did mention a few possibilities for the money, including the option of new high schools or relocating current high schools. Jumping right into the high school discussion about um, number of high schools, location of high schools, and feasibility of uh, relocating high schools or Dr. Howard also mentioned the district will discuss the possibility of creating freshman centers for its high schools. Again, that discussion will now take place at Thursday's bond meeting. Midland ISD is not the only school district considering a bond for the upcoming ballot. Crane ISD has a new bond proposal up for election this May, totaling $68 million. It includes enhancements to district-wide safety and security, high school improvements, a new middle school, career and technology education renovations, early child improvements. This would add $25 to property taxes on a $150,000 home. For the full list on what will be on the school district ballots, head to yourbasin.com tonight. And be sure to watch ABC Big 2 News at 6 and 10 tomorrow night for a 